Some of Australia's youngest voters are making a push for climate change policies to top the agenda for the coming federal election. About 1,500 people at a youth climate summit are calling for the carbon tax to stay, more investment in renewable energy and for coal-fired power to be phased out. From Pacific Islanders and a conference video showing the threat of rising sea levels. Sea level rise and unusually big waves. To Australians who've seen erosion take its toll on local beaches. The surf club is basically falling into the water and the park that I used to run around and, swim, like, and ride my scooter around has completely disintegrated. The 1,500 people at this year's Power Shift Youth Summit came from many locations but were on common ground. These young Australians considering their vote already have a list of policies they want. Keeping coal and gas in the ground, investing in renewable energy like sun and the wind and keep reducing our emissions here in Australia. Definitely keeping uh, a price on pollution. So things like protecting the Great Barrier Reef, things like building Australia's first uh, solar thermal plant in Port Augusta. Prominent environmentalists also address the summit. Drive those emissions down, close or clean up the coal-fired power plants, shift to renewable energy and, and, and then we can take a break. We're going to lose jobs, we're going to lose investment in this area and if we wait until it's too late it's very hard to recover. The summit runs until Monday when there will be a political Q&A involving Labor, the Coalition and the Greens. Jackie Peake, ABC News, Melbourne.